Now, TNA-wise, a lot of people... I don't think a lot of people really watch TNA unless they're bored, you know. To a lot of people, TNA is garbage. A lot of people will disagree and say they like TNA and whatnot. But the TNA World Heavyweight Champion, Bobby Roode, Bobby Lashley, Sting, you know. Oh, the Sting's not there no more, but whoever's the champion, I don't think many people really care, you know. Even if Jeff Hardy is the World Champion... The TNA World Champion, nobody really cares. Like, it's just the fact that nobody really watches TNA. <laughs> they always complain about, you know, like, TNA events not having many people there. Empty arenas and TNA events, I mean, they try to build new stars. Some people like Austin Aries, Bobby Roode. They're not as well advertised as people like Randy Orton or, you know, John Cena. People like that. I don't think Bobby Roode is as big, you know. Maybe if Bobby Roode was in the WWE and he's a world a WWE champion, that'd be a different story. But if he were to go to the WWE, you know, they'd probably bury him. That's what they suppose. It goes for AJ Styles, Austin Aries, any of them, you know. I mean, all I'm trying to say is the TNA World Heavyweight Champion. I don't think anyone really cares if Bobby Roode wins it or if Austin Aries wins it. Bobby Roode's like the Triple H of TNA. Long, like, same kind of look, same ego, same personality, you know. thing about Bobby Roode is, I mean, he's a great athlete, just like Austin Aries and all. I mean, TNA has good wrestlers, but for some reason, TNA is because the reason no one really cares is because it's just not popular enough, you know. Do you really want to, I mean, they have three pay-per-views now, you know. Slammiversary, you know. They try to make... Bubba Ray Dudley Bully Ray, the world champion. Guess what? He's not a world champion anymore. They focus on Bobby Roode, Austin Aries, or even AJ Styles left. TNA is going downhill. But honestly, do you care who the TNA world heavyweight champion is? I mean, I don't really care. I don't watch enough TNA. <laughs> TNA is not that big anymore. Back in 2007, maybe it was okay. Maybe Kurt Angle being a world champion in TNA was a good thing. TNA, Kurt, and Kurt Angle versus Sting, you know. Sting, and you remember Sting versus Jeff Hardy? Jeff Hardy was messed up on drugs, and Sting attacked Eric Bischoff, and Jeff Hardy did nothing. During the match, Eric Bischoff was saying, he's messed up, he's messed up, man, whatever. And The match ended with Sting doing the Scorpion Death Drop to Jeff Hardy and getting the 1-2-3. At, at, today, I think it was called Turning Point, you know. But things like that really put TNA down, you know, the Orlando screw job, you know. Them trying to make fun of the WWE with all their jokes and whatnot. They were, they were making fun of the Nexus a while ago and making fun of Triple uh, Mr. Anderson was making fun of Miss, of Triple H, you know. Mr. Anderson became a TNA world champion. Lost a belt a month later to Jeff Hardy in a ladder match. <laughs> you know, they're trying to push... The, the WWE's release superstars or has been's and the big stars in TNA thinking, hey, if we have these old, you know, WWE stars, maybe we can, maybe TNA will be better. Maybe people will watch Bubba Ray, Dudley, Jeff Hardy, Matt Hardy, whoever. I guess it goes to show you can put the WWE stars in TNA and TNA still won't do that good. But TNA is just terrible and nobody wants to watch it. The retirement home for wrestlers, you know. And that's why nobody really cares for the TNA World Champion.